Hey everybody, today we're going to show you how to complete the EC Sum Shrine here in Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. So without further ado, let's jump into it. All right, so as soon as you enter the shrine, the first thing we're going to do is come down here and grab a few weapons. We're going to work our way to the left side. So we've got a ramp here that we can run up. We're going to encounter our first construct over here. We don't even need to fight him. You can pick up one of the little bombs that's on the ground and drop it on his head. Uh, now these things when you drop them will explode so be careful uh, you can use them to explode the constructs or if you just drop them on them literally it'll take them out or deal damage depending on how much health they have so you'll find a lot of these around the shrine so they'll, they'll be very very useful if you don't want to have to go up and get crazy with with your weapons and risk taking a lot of damage but after you take out the first construct you're going to come over here to this wheel and use recall so that you can get up to the next level and then we're just going to work our way around following the pathway we've got ramps that lead up to the next sections and you're just going to encounter a couple constructs as you continuously move around the room so this one here is a little bit easier to take out I would recommend picking up some of their weapons as well. I end up taking a little bit of damage. I'm using a small weapon. I didn't actually get anything crazy since I have plenty of hearts. I wasn't really too concerned with it. But if you don't have a lot of health and you don't want to really risk it, you can use some of the arrows that you'll pick up or just use better weapons and fuse uh, the horns that these constructs are going to drop. Also, if you jump back down, you guys can see here, uh, me here being super lazy and not wanting to jump down. So I'm just using the arrows. If you do fall down, you just need to use recall on the gears and you can get yourself back up. It's not too bad. Um, but this construct here at the end is going to be the hardest one to take out. Again, you'll notice that you've got some bombs here. If you don't want to go fight them, just pick up the bomb and drop it next to them. And, uh, and you can take them out pretty easily. I didn't really figure that one out until the last second, but just be really careful as these things, uh, when they take a couple seconds to blow up. So if you drop one and you're too close, it will deal a lot of damage. So make sure that you are staying a good distance away. But once you take out that final construct up top, you'll complete the shrine, you'll get all your gear back, the final door will open and you'll be able to go inside and get the chest and complete the shrine. But if you guys have any other questions on how to get this done, then make sure to leave them down in the comment section below and we'll see you guys in the next video.